Well, what is that? That is the boy, boy light. Yeah. Thank you, boy. That's why I like my GoPro. Well, I'm Ranger Koki, and today I'm going to do that test that me and Donnie did that, and failed this machine. And the reason why we failed this machine because we didn't read the book. Reading the book is important. Uh, so when you buy an item, it can save your freaking life, and you don't read the instructions how to use it, it's not your. It's your fault. Not my fault, or it's your fault because you forgot to read the manual. The manual is there for a reason. Like me and Donnie found out in the last video about the bore light, which you just saw. And I'm going to do the retest now in this rainy condition. I have my phone, I have my other parts of charging, and see if this thing really lights up or charge my phone or batteries. So stay tuned, we're going to get it right now. Alright, I'll see you in this video. Alright, I'm Ranger Kuki, and I'm getting this fire started. We're going to see if this thing really works like it says. Uh, me and Donnie forgot to read the instructions, which is very important to do. So we're going to see if this thing really charged my phone. So I'm getting all the parts out. It says you're supposed to charge this thing on your computer or your or some type of electrical device to get it going to stabilize the battery. So we're going to say if this thing really works like it says it does. I got a lot of wet wood, so I hope it uh, dries out and catches this stuff on fire. Has a little small fan that turns around all the uh, fire. So I got all this wet wood. It's burning pretty good. It's going to smuggle her for a while. I keep the skeeters at bay. So I got my phone. <clears throat> and I got this little miniature uh, light from the dollar store. Just to do a test to see if this thing comes on. Now the light's not coming on, I see that. But we're gonna, we're gonna wait and see what happens. We're gonna keep a flame in this baby. You can cook on this too if you've seen Donnie and the Ranger cooking together. You see that we were cooking on this baby. It should take about 20 minutes to get a charge or start charging. If not, that means something's wrong with this device. I put it on a computer. Like uh, my friend told me to do. Let's see if it cuts on. That's odd. Cut on, but is it charging? So far, no charge. This phone should cut on if it was getting a charge. But we're going to see what happens in a few minutes.
got a little leveled. Oh, my phone came on. Not because of that. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Oh. This to make sure we are getting no charge. I have this device here. Y'all seen it with me and Donnie. And I'm gonna plug it in and see if I get a alright the lights are on. Okay, I'm gonna turn it out of the uh, computer plug it in here in my phone to make sure the wire is not different turn it off and see if I can plug it in while I turn it, the machine on ah it's charging so knowing that that this battery is charged and it charged the light made the light come on and my phone charge it should work with this device. Let's see if we can plug the light in. Yes! It works! Yes! Look at that, folks! Woo! -hoo! Boy, me and Dottie was pissed off that video. You should have seen us. We were mad like hell. Damn, it doesn't work! Oh, man! So Dottie did a little research, and he said... We had to do this because we forgot to read the damn instructions. So I'm going to see if it charged my phone now. Oh man, this is so good, man! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, I'm plugging my phone, turn it off. Without touching any buttons, I'll plug it in to see if it charges my phone. Yes! Yes! It is working like a charm. Look at that. My phone is now being charged. I'm going to put the light back on. This is a little light. Let's we'll see if this baby cuts on again. Yes, it works. <laughs> Damn, hot did it go? So we know it works now. Uh, we finally read the instructions, but here's the question. Is there a power bag in this thing? And it's making the light come on? I don't know. Is it got enough juice in there? But it didn't cut on when I first put it on there. So something must be charging a battery cell that's in the pack here to give it that light source that's a lot of, that's a bright little light here to be charged by that well folks I'm glad it works I'm happy now I believe Donnie Paolini will be also happy that the, this item works like I uh, me and Donnie said before make sure if you buy a device can save your life read the instructions because if you don't read the instructions and you go out in the middle of the woods you forgot to do one freaking thing to save your life. You're screwed. So, I hope we learn a lesson about equipment. Equipment is important to us, especially our survival and bushcrafters that go in the middle of the woods and depend on this equipment to save our lives. That's what most of this is, is a test. Us bushcrafters, or nothing but big boy scouts, using minimum gear, except for a few. Look, you can see the battery, the uh, cell of the light is going down. Look at that. It's going a little damn that it was because of the fire, I guess. So, uh, so never. Make sure you read the instructions on your survival gear. Because it might say, oh, you must charge it 10 minutes before use. Which, yeah, I can see the difference. The batteries, the light is going down because I have less wood in the thing. So I'm just going to let that burn down. 
I did the test and Donnie helped me with doing the test and it works. It works, Donnie! So, you had a choice to use this or that. Only problem is wet wood. But if you pick some up beforehand and you got some at your camp already dried, it could save your life. Basically, to charge your phone or your radio system, maybe. I don't know if you got a radio that charges on batteries. You can always bring chargeable batteries. I'm wondering if I can charge batteries on this thing that uses like DC power. All right, I'm Ranger Cookie. I hope you enjoy this quick uh, review of the Bolight, the new test, and it works. So I thought it was a piece of crap. I thought I was gonna throw it away. I thought I was gonna call and bitch at him. Damn you, you show me crap! But I have something very, very good. All right, I'm Richard Cookie. I hope you enjoy my videos. So come on along with me and my friends and friends and friend friends. I'll see you next video. Whoa, hold me. Well, since it's raining, I'm gonna spin the camera. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa,